RK coming in here acting like he's not a legend. Excuse me. They. Uh, the two of them. <laughs> and of course, Candy as well. Candy is like the Ultimo legend. Oh, Lord. Don't break anything. What are you doing? Last stream until vacation. I'm like breaking shit. I mean, not on purpose. <laughs> Anywho, thank you for all for dropping in early. To you, I say cheers. Um, if I had to pick R or K for being more of a legend, who would it be? That's easy. Whoever is the more moist human being at the time, clearly. Satan, thank you for the contribution of channel points. <laughs> um, so yeah, for those who do not know, um, Wednesday morning, me and Treebeard are taking off with uh, some other friendos down to Baltimore for Maryland Death Fest. It is a um, long weekend of Memorial, Memorial Day weekend here in the U.S. Um, and... Uh, it's going to be outrageous and it's probably going to be the last one they ever do because booking these giant festivals is becoming much more difficult. Uh, it was difficult before COVID. COVID just made it even worse. So um, the the two friends that book the Maryland Death Fest every year, they're, uh, they're taking in basically like, they're basically saying it's quits without saying it's quits so that if they want to do another one in a few years, they can, which cool if they do. If they don't, I totally get it. Um, so I'm excited for it big time. Um, yeah, I, I, Candy, I will. It's going to be awesome. I'm very excited. Uh, yeah, rip indeed, Fry, rip indeed. Um, especially with the fact that we lost Bloodbath this year. I was excited to see them again because the first time I saw them was at my first MDF. Um, my God, seven years ago? Couldn't have been that long. Anywho, um... So this is our last stream because tomorrow night I'm going to be going to sleep pretty early. I have to be at the terminal by like 8 a.m., technically a little bit before that. So I got to get up and I have to like get my ass out of bed at like 4.35 in the morning. So let's show off my new emote. You can show off your new emotes anytime. That's a fantastic emote. <laughs> HOV for the win. Um, better yet, I'm doing Logan Express. I drive there, I park my car. There's a shuttle once every 30 minutes. I don't have to worry about driving through morning bullshit. And then I just wait to get to my, uh, the terminal and hop off. Go have my fun through Logan, uh, through Logan Airport. It's the only reason why I stay up late and hey, well, we appreciate you, buddy. Thank you for coming in. <laughs> so uh, without further ado, I really would like to see if we can beat Tormented Souls tonight. So I'm just going to jump right on over, if that's okay with everybody here. Um, yeah, so every, everyone's in here. It's a lovely Monday. Um, all right, so we're in some type of safe room. I don't, I don't know where we left off. I know we're in like the basement or something like that. Oh, there's no map for this, is there? No, there isn't. Shit. I just realized that there is no map. It's a weird location for a toilet. And there's nothing here to collect. That's kind of weird. Maybe I already collected it and I just forgot. But anywho, um, we opened up that secret door that had like the three keys we had to find. I just honestly don't remember where to go or what we've done already. Or what I even have for fucking ammo. Alright, I have one heal point. I need to use it. I have one electric shock left. And after that, it's crowbar. Oh, I killed that dude already. I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> Oh yeah, I think we went 
I came like all the way back here. What else is down here? I don't remember. Wait, what was in this door? Oh fuck, it's this puzzle, that's right. Okay. Um still have an exam, but fuck them. I pass world studies with 83. Dude, that's more than passing. That's a great job. Good for you, man. Um my younger brother actually is a senior in high school and he just finished up he got like high honors or whatever like all year so he doesn't have any exams to take at all so his last day of school was this past friday and he's like cool i'm just gonna hang out <laughs> but uh he's heading off um he's heading out to uh a college locally here um next year i'm very proud of him he's gonna kick some serious ass much smarter than i am uh let's see so i am okay right so what this is this is a giant puzzle room and i got through like a couple of the rooms and i didn't understand i ended up looking it up afterwards um so this i've heard to start a new adventure i wish only to find what every ambitious man looks for to escape poverty and of course what's that it's gold so there should be a gold door somewhere yeah it's this one golden door we go through here now watch the chandelier there's no lights on. You go through the door. Now there's something lit. That's the correct answer. So the next one. Next puzzle. I fall into the sea and never learned to swim. I'm three feet under the water. My only wish is to have that which we've had for all our lives. For now, its absence will kill me. And that apparently is... The basin is empty. He, he wants to have basically nothing and start and be back to it. And we have to go through this door because it's adjacent to that. So if I go through here, we get two. We do. Okay, so they're not fucking bullshitting me. 0451. No. <laughs> yeah, I may have to delay the IRL stream coming later that week. Yeah, man. Yeah, it's, you do you. Um, so the next one. I was rescued by a crew of sailors, but we are lost. I long to follow the light of the stars in the Ursa Minor constellation in the night sky and ursa minor apparently is in the north so you look at the compass it's north you get three lights now chandelier yep cool the furious storm sank the boat will soon be fully underwater in these desperate moments i focus only on finding something that will help me afloat we need to get lilo she's the fifth element this is true this is very true. Um, you know, to find something that will keep you afloat, that's going to be wood. Unless, of course, you're Leonardo DiCaprio, then you're not going to be able to get to hop on that wooden clock with Kate Winslet. It is what it is. Satan is here. How you doing, my friend? Um, so the next one... I am floating alone, adrift in the open sea. I gaze at the horizon, hoping to catch a glimpse of seagulls flying in the sky. Okay. And apparently this one is, uh, the dirt basin. I don't know why it's dirt. Is this dirt? Oh, earth. Okay. And now we have five. Next one. I awoke on a desert island, the night draws close, but there is something I must do before darkness falls and the cold pierces my bones. That one is the Ember Basin, which makes sense because you want to uh, build a fire. It's cold. Alright, so they're all lit, so there's probably one more to go. Oh, you know what? I think that bot is down, RK. I have the same exact bot. Um, I have the same exact bot that Heavy has and it was having issues. So anybody that uses that, I'll, I'll make sure I redeem those. Days have passed and see no sign of boats on the horizon. I will die here, I'm sure of that. And before I close my eyes forever, I wish to look towards the setting sun on the horizon once more. I wish to look towards the setting sun on the horizon. So, of course, the sun sets in the west. I like how the compass is an O. That's interesting. 
Here we go. Achievement unlocked. Loop. Oh, boy. Oh, this doesn't look good. Oh. Oh, oh, no. I can't. I can't do this. I can't. I can't win this battle. It's impossible. I have no heals. <laughs> Looks great. <clears throat> so, here's the story. I have no heals, but I, oh, I'm in caution. Okay, so that's actually worse than I thought. I thought it was actually fair. Um, I have one electric shock and a crowbar. That's it. Um, I, thanks, Demon. We just had that conversation. The the bot is down. Um, heavy hand swings was using it too, and it was not working. Uh, all right, they're two of the same things. They're the two big boys. They're going to be strong. Maybe I can find something helpful. They're also not looking at me, which is great. There's nowhere else I can go. I wonder why they're not aggroing me. I'm very concerned. Yeah, I'm fucked in the short term. Yes, correct. Everybody's, uh... Everybody knows how fucked I am on this one. So, alright, let's just do it. Jesus, it's like a mosh pit. Run, run. Oh, no. Well... Okay, we have a small problem. I need to find ammo, pronto. All right, so what's this way? Does this go back upstairs? I think it does. I mean, obviously it's going back upstairs. It's a stupid observation. Yeah, this goes back to, yep, the main hall, the underneath. There's nothing back upstairs at all. I've cleared the entire building out. So, wife tells me we have a small problem all the time. <laughs> the app crashed and died. Bro, you gotta get off the app. The Twitch app is garbage. Alright, there's nothing. This was here. Oh, no, okay. I thought there might have been a doorway. Fine. So, we'll go down here. Um, over to the right where this dead corpse is. That's where we just went to the puzzle. Let's go back down here into the mausoleum. And let's see if I can find anything except for pu more puzzles. Damn it. I don't think there's any more there's any more like ammo left in this game right now up to this point. Hug the left. Yep, this is the, uh, this is like the, the podium and like the meeting room hallway or some shit. Yeah, I had quite a battle down here, as you can see. Alright. There's nothing in these wheelchairs. Oh, there's a, hold on, hold on. I did forget a piece of literature. Why have they taken me away from what I love the most? Are they tested my determination? The roads of salvation are full of thorns, and I've always known that, but I do not expect one of them to pierce through my heart so cruelly. Your death gives me more strength to carry on with my mission. I will see you again soon, Chris, uh, Christina. Oh, okay, interesting. I have with a band twitch on the laptop. I'm going to be held typing on the Xbox. Oh, is it your school laptop? Oh, that sucks. Shoes, what's up, my friend? How are you doing, buddy? <clears throat> Hope all is well. We're just uh, trying to beat Tormented Souls, and I'm realizing I'm at a spot 
where I need ammo and more than likely some heals. And the problem is, ain't none of that happening. All right, that's a door that way. Let me check over here. Yeah, this is a puzzle spot if I recall. Yeah, right here. I don't know what to give this thing. I can't use the hammer. That's unfortunate. That'd been really nice. Can I use the stethoscope? Nope. WE40. Nope. Staple gun, obviously. Yeah, nothing. So none of this is really going to work out well. Um, unless there's something here I'm supposed to grab and I just didn't see it. Can't buy the one life too much like it. Those packs. So wait, you're so you're buying trading cards, and then just fl uh, you're flipping them for more money or something. Yeah, I figured I cleared this place out too. Shit. This is gonna be really difficult. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to pull this off. The carving on the golden plate reads the beautiful archangel suddenly lifted his finger, golden shine from his ring almost blinded me, and suddenly the gates of hell were wide open only for me. Is there anything in these little where the flowers are? Big marble tomb, there's a sculpture of a young woman holding canoe flowers. The stench of corpses blends with the aroma of the flowers. So yeah, I think I'm kind of screwed in that bazaar. This puzzle took me a while. So, Roy, am I supposed to go through the other puzzle first with like the four doors and the four pillars, or the basins rather? Or do I solve this one first before going in? Because maybe this will give me some ammo and shit. Maybe especially the rarity of the card and the price. Ah, uh, that seems kind of a gamble, my dude. You can get all shitty cards out of it, then you're out of money, and you still don't got a computer. Now you can do this one separate. Oh, cool, cool. So you know what I'm gonna do? Um, I'm gonna be a little bitch, and I'm gonna look it up. I'm gonna try at least. Or at least I think I could, but I can't seem to find where that is. Huh. This person doesn't have it in their walkthrough, that's interesting. If you can look it up, just ask me. Well, fine. Press the pinky. Oh, for fuck's sakes. Oh, because the ring on the finger. Mm, I should have known. Okay, I should have known that. I just read it. Thank you. There best be some good yeah, shit down here. Screw it. Twisted, my dude. Thank you very much for the biddies. Yeah, ring finger makes sense. All right, all right, demon, have a good night, dude. Good luck with uh, good luck with your exams. Good luck with the trading cards and all that. Um, as for Twisted, because he's so nice and generous here, it's time for some whiskey. See, I like the whiskey more than I like the hot sauce. I'm just gonna throw that out to you people. What does it matter? You don't care. As long as you see me suffer. Jeez, oh, we're getting, uh, hello there. It's okay, I bought a bottle of Maker's Mark. We'll be good to go once this is done. To Twisted, may he, uh, live long and prosper. Oh. 
That was a bigger pour than I was expecting. Thick whiskey. Oh, I don't remember how to pronounce that again. You got me. I failed the test. I'd prefer the whiskey to hot sauce, too. <laughs> All right, so this is interesting. We're in a new room. Hopefully there's no enemies down here. There's just nothing but fantastic ammo and health galore. That's what I want. Nothing but ammo and... Ammo. <laughs> ammo and health. Then we go back up. We can get through that puzzle room again. Uh-oh. Hear footsteps. Is that? Oh fuck! It's the big boy. If it's just one, I'll be fine. I'm gonna go around and just check the other way too. Cause I can zap him. They'll get him on the floor. <laughs> Open the door. Everybody walks the dinosaur. And then I put a crowbar to his face a few times. Oh, no, it's a dead end. Okay. Well, isn't that such as life right there? You take the right path, sometimes the only path, you worry about it, and then you change your mind at the last minute. Just to realize it was the best way to go anyways. Alright, dickhead, let's play. Hey. Hello. Sees me? God, that was stupid. Wasn't feeling that at all. Dumb AI. Okay, we're in trouble. Very big trouble. down here that's going to be helpful for me. Anything. More than a fucking notebook. 16th of August, 1969. Members of the sect are getting restless. We have fewer twin babies to offer, and our attempts to force their conception of test subjects have wholly failed. We have only managed to get defective specimens, Siamese fetuses that are so misshapen, misshapen, sorry, that they are incapable of surviving long after the cesarean section. Oh, Lord. If this continues, I'll lose my position as High Priest of the Pollock Sect. I'm afraid that without my leadership, the other members will grow bolder. This might raise suspicions about our cult. ruh -row. That doesn't sound good for you. For me, I couldn't give two shits. What's this? Okay. I can do that. <coughs> Yo, Sassafras! What's up? Welcome in! I am once again trying to beat a game that I thought I was supposed to beat two streams ago. Could really use some fucking health. What's that? Who could perform medical procedure in a place like this? Someone who's not well, obviously. This kind of weird music change right there. Very drastic and sudden. This doesn't look good. Uh. Alright, so so far, I have a good return on investment for this because I've got more shock stuff. What's this? <clears throat> March 19th, 1991. Sometimes I dream at night. In my dreams, the wind dances with the smell of flowers and caresses my face. 
The afternoon sun paints the clouds behind the mountains in sepia, sepia, and lilac tones. My heart fills with joy. I'm sitting on a beautiful balcony full of plants and flowers, all of them full of life. I go back inside the room and see the wall covered with gorgeous green wallpaper. Wallpaper? The place smells wonderfully of lavender. There's a big mirror in front of me. I go to it slowly, unable to resist the curiosity my reflection appears on the glass. Yeah, that's how mirrors work. That's me! But not exactly. The person in the reflection has clean and treated hair. Her smooth skin glows with a slight tan. Her lips are as red as ripe fruit. I admire her for a few moments with nothing but envy and suddenly, my chest tightens. Rage poisons my blood and my eyes turn red, and giving into the murder instinct, I hurl myself to the neck of that person. That person so similar to me, but whose confused eyes betray her as an imposter. I feel the pressure of the blood in her uh, carotid artery through my fingers. Her mouth tries to articulate a word, but I push even harder, afraid of what she might say, so I push some more. I wake up in the dark, soaking in sweat. The sound of sewer water and the air currents make me realize that I'm in my room. But the lavender smell carries on, floating a few moments until it escapes completely through the bars. Jesus. Is that how it always goes, though? Yeah. I'm not near the end? Oh, for fuck's sakes, it's gonna be a late night. Once I get some fucking ammo around here, that'd be nice. I haven't seen a nail in probably the last hour and a half of this game. Nope, I hear you. Sorry, I'm out. Okay, so he's that way. And I can hear him over there. Okay. This is not good. What the fuck is that? A young child's doodles drawn in blood. Got it. <sighs> Not good. Like, all these places could be giving me armor. Uh, armor. <laughs> that was a mean trick. This is going to take forever. Maybe with the dumb AI in the first room there, I can get around him because he did not know what the hell he was doing. Nope, not that way. I mean, maybe they all can do that at this point where I can just sneak around them. So they don't seem very smart. They're following a pattern. Except for that last dude there. That was kind of a shit show. That man was waiting for me. There's nothing I can do about it. But, I don't know. I just need to... I need to limit my engagement with these people. Or things. And just worry about... Running and surviving and picking stuff up as I picking stuff up as I go. Alright. Ring finger. So something tells me this puzzle here is progression into the story, but that other room I found may have just been like a little secret room or something. I don't know. Around here. Yep. Hear the footsteps. Just get the light up so we can see. see me. I'm running. Pick those up. Run all the way back. 
this is what we call work harder, not smarter. Oh, I missed my chance. So I stood here before and he didn't notice me. Go. Oh, you idiot. Part, you know what, there's a piece of diary back there. I'm just so... I'm good. <laughs> okay. So, let's see what this door even opens. I didn't, I didn't even try it. Unlocked. Okay. What's on the side? Pumping room. Oh, I think I found this room before. Yeah, I did. There's a dead body there. I definitely killed that. What's up here? Oh, we're back in the office. Interesting. That emote is great. <laughs> Why do I have scary music? No, 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 no scary music. <laughs> I forgot about flapjack titty. Oh my god, I forgot about flapjack titties. Oh my god. I'm glad you're liking Dead Cedar. I'm like, I don't know why I hear scary music and then flapjack titties. She attacked. See, I don't think there's anything else I could do in this room. But this is interesting that I can get back here. If only there was stuff back here for me to grab. Oh well. <sighs> but that's, I like being able to unlock doors like that because it's, you're able to then traverse a lot easier, which is nice. The bad news is, that's the bad news. Damn it. I don't want to fight these things, you know? Alright, I think he's back down the tunnel. Like, if it was just one of these dudes, I'd feel a lot better. Can I go into the water? No. This is the uh, child's book. We've already read it. You know, there's another guy around here. They, they time this so well, too. Because you see something shiny at the end of the walkway there. And that's why I was like, oh, what's that? And I walked right up like it was no big deal. I mean, they fucking get you. Look at him. Look at this motherfucker. I can see him right now. Come on. Let's play. Can I get to it? Oh. Well, well, well. What a tangled web we weave. I keep... 
There we go. The right click being exit really has been bothering me. <laughs> this entire game, I consistently do it. Alright, I can't go that way. There must be stairs to get down there somehow. My assumption is it's back over here. So there were definitely stairs here. <laughs> yeah! Oh my. All ove. I forgot the art. They were submerged under the water this whole time. I mean, yeah, that's what it looks like. Alright, I can't go any further than that. Fine by me. Let's keep going down. An old television dial. Okay, sure. Yep, the same text is up there. something in front of the scanner. It's literally a retinal scan. How the hell am I going to pull this off? Just bang the fuck out of it. No. Alright, so I'm not opening that up anytime soon, but that looks important. Alright, so we need to go find some eye, or a face, or a head. Something along those lines. So I guess we'll head back over this way. Oh wait, I can't go there, it's always a dead end. I need to go where the other footsteps are coming from. I'll just wait here, patiently. Because I really don't want to fight this dude in a fucking small alleyway, and he'll be coming from where the camera is. Mm. Come on, chase me, bitch. Fine. There's no fail horn here. I got him. He's back up. I pull out the last shot. Go back to my crowbar. Just brain something. Motherfucker. Yeah, ain't so tough now, huh? Okay. Now we go this way. That's a dead end. Nothing in the lockers, because of course. Oh, great. Nothing there. And this is... Door. The sewer storage room. A save point. Oh, and a mirror, too. That's a little sketch. I do some reading here. Oh, look at that. 28436 is some type of lock for something. 27 November 1994. Grandfather Noah came to my prison with the revolver in his hand. When I turned to him, he stepped back and kept the gun level. You're alive, he said, surprised. After all these years, you're alive. I was stunned. It was him, really him. The man who had imprisoned me and left me forgotten all these years. I wanted to throw myself at him, but he had the gun pointed at me, and I knew better than anyone the terrible physical condition my imprisonment had put me in. This is very fortunate, a sign of God, he continued. I will finally have the Wildberger twins together. Once Anna arrives, I will finally open the vault and gain access to the temple. Just a little longer, my child, just a little longer. Yeah, I, I'm definitely the sister in this regard. After that, he walked out without turning back. I followed him to the exit, but as expected, he had locked it. 
It's the last thing I will write. I have been a prisoner down here all these years, but if he thinks he has control over my destiny, he is wrong. To open the temple entrance, he needs a set of twins to offer themselves to retina scanners. He needs the two of us, Emma and me. He will not use my eyes. I will stop him. The blade is red hot. I have to do this. Emma, if you ever read this, do all you can to survive. Live a normal life. Forget about me. And if you see Father Todd, tell him that I was locked down here all these years. What I'm about to do to myself, I do not want him to see me like that. Let this be my last decision. I found the decision I made for myself. Oh, God. Oh, boy. So, 28436 is interesting, though. So, remember that. Emma, don't come to the vault. Save yourself from hell. Oh, God. Alright, we got some heals. That's nice. Oh, 28436. Look at that. It seems broken. I can't move it. Oh, the dial. What? Fuck. Yeah, no, I would totally do 28436, but it's not letting me attach anything. Maybe there's something else in this room or somewhere similar. Someone was living here. Gee, you think? Alright, there's a save reel. Alright, there's really nothing else in here but except for that mirror, which we're gonna have to go through. Let me go ahead and save progress. I don't have acid, that was like WD 40. Need the lighter. There we go. Ooh, nifty. Caroline's What? Bedroom. Is this my room? But this is hundreds of miles away from the mansion. How can this be possible? Because we're Emma, a doy. And this explains why my fucking eye is missing. It happened again last night. I had that nightmare. The one where I fall into the void, squeeze my eyes tight, and icy cold hits my back. When I finally open my eyes, I see dirty water running through stone channels and pipes leading down endless tunnels with arched ceilings. I see shadowy human silhouettes and misshapen heads projected onto moldy walls. A man in a radioactive suit grabs my arm and with a guttural roar yells, Let the ritual begin. I wake up drenched in their fetid sweat, take the sheets off my body, and put my feet on the floor. Only to discover that it too is wet. I turn on the lamp to find a room not my own. The walls dirty, and the window that faces the streets now the mouth of a dark tunnel where sewage flows. I get up numb. A stream of putrid cold air hits me. When I look at my reflection in the mirror, I see myself but dressed in rags. My hair dirty and matted, confused and scared. It is me, or so it seems. But there's something in her eyes I do not recognize. The person on the other side of the mirror stretches out her arms and grabs me by the neck. You left us here. I wake up back in my room. The light from the street lamps enters through the window, silhouetting the leaves of the plants. I slowly remove my hands from my neck and the TV turns on. I pinch myself to make sure that this time I'm awake. The dial turns to the right and at times to the left. The TV showing seemingly random images, but always the same. Jesus Christ. Okay. Wow. So she had so she has dreams with her twin and her twin wrote about the same exact dream being on the other side of the mirror and they don't recognize it because it's their twin sister that were separated years and years ago I'm not going out there yet Claws I feel like changing right now oh okay I feel like I need to go touch the TV. Five, four, one. I guess that would be a four if you look at the top of the die. Oh, spider. Which is eight. Oh, I saw that tricycle in the basement. Yin yang. 
four leaf clover. Hmm. So eight, three, two, four. And that one's tough. I don't know. Maybe it's the no, because that'd be ten if you add it up. The top of the die is a four, though. It's not happening. Eight, three, two, four, four. Eight, three, two, four, four. Weird. Okay, let's try to learn more about the girls from the photo. Okay. I really want to break that big mirror behind me and escape through this window, but I can't. Something that just won't let me. Well, what else am I supposed to be doing in here? Like, that seems helpful, but... Just want to get changed there. There's nothing else I can really do here. I should go back. Oh my god. Emma, don't come to the vault. Save yourself from hell. It's a warning for Emma, one of the missing twins. It may be possible that one of the girls is inside the vault. I must find a way to get in. And then this, I don't know what to fucking use on it. I've got nothing. There's also no map for down here. Anything up on the shelves I can grab? No. Someone's living here. Mirror. Save point. Nothing. Health. Not what we just did. Alright, we'll go back out here, I guess. Back to the sewer. Not like I have many other choices to go here, though. What's this? Shotgun shells? Oh, you sweet, sweet, sweet game. Six of them, too. Hit the wrong fucking button. Nice. So... I don't think there's much else I can really do down here. I'm confused of where to actually go to get an eyeball. I mean, outside of my own. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. Cry! Right. Blankets. <laughs> hey, that's a good conversation to have. Blankets are fantastic. Take a look down here one more time. And there's the other one. Hence why you need two to open up the vault. Mm. So I mean, realistically, where else in the hospital have I not been to? Because I've been everywhere else. All of these rooms, I'm like, yep, 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 yep. Oh, for Christ's sakes. Alright, so apparently that... The TV isn't a hint. That's actually a puzzle. I don't understand. Like, I just read through it. I don't understand how we were supposed to know that one. Ugh. 
excuse me. But regardless, I have the answer in front of me. So head back in here. I enjoy a good blanket. Better have some good weight to it too. I've never tried out the weighted blankets before, and I'm really interested in trying it out. Okay, so it says start on the yin yang. Turn dial right clockwise eight times to the spider. Uh huh. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Turn dial left counterclockwise five times to the four leaf clover. One, two, three, four, five. Turn dial right clockwise seven times to the tricycle. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Turn dial left counterclockwise four times to the dial. One, two, three, four. Um, I don't think that works. Knocks me out every time. <laughs> Oh, you have to shut the TV off and turn it back on. Okay, that makes sense. So clockwise eight times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four. The, um, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm cheating because I'm trying to get the game done. And uh, they, they neglected to mention that there's a jump scare when you get this uh, necklace here. So there's, there's always that, I guess. So. All right, a necklace with a sun design. And now apparently we can head back. And now that safe's gonna randomly be open. Yeah. Don't know why. Moon design. Sun and moon. Great. What if you can combine them? Hey! Nice. Anna and Emma. Oh. I feel like this goes somewhere. I've seen this, like this image before without the faces on it. Children's bedroom, of course, of course. And that's why that door's there to unlock to get back in. Let's go, okay. I'm hoping that I can get a lot further by right here. I mean, I'll probably play until one before I start thinking about like a time to time to end it. Fortunately, we don't have to deal with flapjacks at some point. I know it. All right, there's that. I think it's this way. Yep, and then around to the left. This is where, this is the hallway where we met Flapjack, so she might be here. I'm not gonna stick around and find out. Okay, so here in the children's room should be something I could put that into right here. <coughs> That is an aggressive safe room. Remembrance achievement unlocked.
this music box is going to have that same set and that same song, and we're going to be like, <gasps> oh. Uh -huh. I don't like this camera views. Make the realization, girl. Come on. How oh, you can do it? My head. What is this? I know this song. I know it. It's the song my sister and I used to listen to when we were children. My sister. My sister Anna. I remember. I am Emma. The girl who fell from the bridge 14 years ago. No shit. All this time, I've kept the traumatic memories hidden inside my head. But this song has set them free. Anna, you have been alone in the dark this whole time. I don't know if you are still there, but I promise I will do everything in my power to find you. She sounds very determined. It's time to find out what's behind the vault door in the sewers. But... We need the eyes. Two hundred dollar music now. It's just creepy. <laughs> Dollhouse, of course. There's the tricycle. Oh, diary. Fifteen September, nineteen eighty. Mother told us to stay away, but we didn't listen. We decided to investigate the forest next to the main garden. We were curious, but when we heard the hitting and screaming sounds. I got scared and asked Emma to go back to the house. She insisted on seeing where the noises were coming from. She went ahead and I followed. Within a glade, we discovered three men in full body outfits. They stood under huge rocks carved with symbols and were using hammers to hit a large red stained bag, which seemed to writhe or writhe. One of them poured some liquid over the bag and they set it on fire. The bag started to move with more force. I got scared and snapped the twig I was holding. The men looked in our direction and pointed towards us. I took Emma by the wrist and ran. We broke through thorny bushes all the time, listening to the men's fading shouts. Finally, we made it to the mansion, but the pr but the pretty dresses mother had made were ruined. Oh, so that's what happened to the dresses. So tired, I thought you said, "Oh, diarrhea!" My God, the voice actor is like an EWTN host. <laughs> I understand you, Fry. It's uh, and you're finally feeling better too. So yeah, definitely get some sleep. Appreciate you being here as always. A metal fishing hook with a sharp point. Do I use it on my other eye? Like, what's up? So that was our mother's song, apparently. Okay. So what do I use this song now? Gonna cheat. Well, I actually have to go back to the office. Okay. Shit. 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 Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Go. Where the. Ah, it didn't work. Run. Dude, what the fuck? Oh, this sucks. Oh, my God. Well, that sucks. Alright, so now we know what to do here. So just take a second. Is this... La -da 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 -da. Okay. Clockwise would be right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 
One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four. Ready for you that time. Now let's get the diary. Goddamn flapjack titty bitch. She needs to go float somewhere else. I mean, and I didn't want to like waste ammunition on her either. But the smart thing would have been to turn around, go back into the door that I just came out of, and then come right back out. But no. I had to be a dummy. Okay. Yep, good, great. Sick. Nope. Smarter this time. And now she'll be gone. See? Logic. Okay. What's this? Oh, we have a new tape to watch, it appears. Dentist room, 110694. Hmm. Okay. So we need to get this situation in control, which means to go through the front door, run up, and the one on the right. Okay. Nope. Let's try that one more time. Eject the tape, take the chapel tape, and then we're gonna grab the dentist tape, the red one, plop it in, hit play, and oh, oh boy. Yep, let's do it. <sighs> oh, this sucks, because that thing was in here, and I remember killing it. Oh, it's twitching. That's why it appears to have been operating on multiple times. Doesn't even look human anymore. Who's doing this? I keep getting that text throughout the game. I want to make sure not to walk counterclockwise around him. Anything else in here? Well, that door was blocked before. That's interesting. X-ray images. Help. Let's put the dot in the top right hand corner though. I wonder if I can use my uh if I can use the thing on him. This thing here? No. I'll try going out the back door here. Alright, this one. East one quarter.
fuck was that noise? Oh, this is where I start the game. I wonder if I'm in the tub. We are the ones that took our own eye to get into the fucking vault. Oh, that is... That's fucking outrageous. What? Okay, scaffold. That's fair. Oh, this is fucking bizarre. You gotta do it. I mean, you already did if you think about it. Are they gonna show that shit? Okay, good. My right eye, I can't believe I did that to myself. I mean, it makes sense. We gotta get this shit done. The problem is now is... What do we do about the other eye? More diary stuff. 12 December 1994. Late last night, someone broke into the mansion, a young and reckless woman. I do not know what brought her here, nor do I care. I hit her over the head with a lead pipe, which I admit was unwise. Had I hit her much harder, she would not have survived. The potential test subject would have been wasted. She's now unconscious with assisted ventilation. When she has stabilized, I'll inject her with Maria's blood. I'm close to finding the cure. Wait for me, Maria, just a little longer. Oh, jeez, we would have turned. That was some creepy uh, <laughs> Oh god. Okay. So I think that's all I can do in this tape. That was the whole point. Is you're directed to basically go and take care of that situation. Now, what bothers me is where the hell do I get the other eye? You know what I mean? See, if I start going around in circles, one of those things is going to wake up like the other one. No? And that's preferable, so thanks. Okay. Uh, let me just make sure that's all they have to do here. I have a little cheat sheet over here. Uh, dun dun dun. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, I guess that makes sense. Okay. I don't know why I didn't think of that. I should have been able to figure that one out. Combine the... Gross. So we have connected the eyeball to a fishing hook on a fishing line so that we can go and toss that over at one and then use our other eye to get the other one because we're since we're identical twins our eyes are going to be very similar and that will like trick the system and the door may open. Back down he over here, down to the sewers, the pumping room, if you will. All right, now we're in the sewer. Oh, whoops, forgot about that. It's the next one up. So now we need to go and try to open up this door. I feel like this is some endgame material up here for sure. Because the whole deal about this is to open the vault. Alright, so we will use... How do I place my own eye there? Oh. 
It's quite confusing. Okay. Oh boy. Sacrifice. I also didn't pick up the uh, the shotgun shells at the end of this hallway, so I'm gonna go grab those really quick. Um, I have a feeling I'm gonna need more than just whatever the fuck I have right now, which is probably just a crowbar. Which in fact, what do, I, what do I have? I have nothing. <laughs> Absolutely nothing. I'll take the extra time to go get that. I think there were six shotgun shells. at the end. Yep. Yep, six. Hit the wrong button. Fine. Got it. In fact, let's not play it dumb here. Let's be prepared for anything. Is at this rate, who fucking knows what we're about to come up against. find our sister? Is she even still alive? Oops. Or do we find our grandfather, who's completely out of his fucking mind? Or do we find something worse? My bet is going to be something worse, because what's a horror game without a boss battle, right? Alright, let's do it. Uh, what is this? Di uh, Diagon Alley? Touch the bricks the right way? Or someone's going to be behind us. Oh, fuck. The priest. Grandfather Noah? Now I remember Son you. Of a bitch. She's never good soon because she has an absent pupil. Oh, man. Alright, so that was an interesting swerve. I didn't even think about the potential of him being the grandfather and all of this, but it, it totally lines up. Oh, God. You have your memories back. Then you remember that your stupid mother stopped me from sacrificing you and your sister. A sacrifice that could have brought back our savior. Well, God took care of her. He made her pay for her sins. Oh, boy. Yo, Wunsby, thanks for the host, my dude. Again, I don't know why my auto shoutout's not working. Um, I'm gonna give you a quick shoutout. For sure. Are all the bots broken today or something? Jesus Christ. Yeah, something must be going on. Um, apologies, there's supposed to be a clip that plays, but it's not playing. You should shoot this guy. I honestly should. Um, yeah, this uh, the TTS bot's not working. The clip, This clip thing isn't working. Sorry, everybody. I don't know what's going on. I know the other streamers are having issues today. <clears throat> this is all your fault. Did you kill my father too? 
The radiation that comes from the sacred placenta is extremely harmful to us, impure and worthless beings. Oh, I'm worrying about it. 100% worried about it. For years, Bertram and his son William after him lurking since tried to find a cure for the effects oh, of radiation. Don't apologize. Today, William Thank succeeded. You, for, you didn't have to say anything, but I appreciate you coming in and saying hi. And, and a host, for sure. The sacred placenta. After I tried to find a cure for the effects of the radiation, today William succeeded. With this accomplished, I have no use for him anymore. May God welcome him into his realm. You will pay for this, Noah. What have you done to my sister? Where is she? Your sister is just another tool for me to awaken our savior. Follow me if you want your answers. I mean, because he still wants both of us to be sacrificed, so... Oh, hey, boy. wait! Where do you think you're going? He said to follow him, so... There's only one fucking option here. Oh, hi. Suit to keep out radiation. I can feel someone staring at me from the inside. Well, I think that dude's dead. Alright, last piece of diary here. 15 September 1980. Maria has escaped with the girls. I will stay at the temple, blocking the door from the inside. Keep the cult members locked in for as long as possible. Seven bullets will not protect me for long, but I will try to make each one count. William, I do not ask you to forgive me. I do not deserve it. But if one of these letters makes it to you, I want you to know that I am sorry. From the bottom of my rotten soul, I am sorry for everything. Oh, my word. Bunker entrance. Is this... Oh, I thought we were going to be like the last opening thing. All right, well, here we go. We got some nails now. We're getting there. When they're starting to give you ammo, you know it's time. <laughs> Come on. The sacred placenta. Oh, wow. Let's turn this fucker on. Something can be placed here. No fucking way. We need to get those things to get close so I can lock it in place. The question is how. And those things can get turned on. See, I can figure puzzles out without a worker, without a, a walkthrough. I don't know what terrors I'll face below, but if Anna is there, I will find Oh, her, it's no from the TV. What. Bunker stairs. Jeez. How much longer we got here? Nice. More of that ammo. Jeez, fuck. Anything else around here I can yeah, pick up? Twisted! My man, thank you so much. Let me give Twisted a quick shout out. If you guys aren't following Twisted yet, uh, now is the time. Uh, I know this is not gonna work, 
but theirs is Link to begin with. But, uh, he's another fellow horror streamer of mine, and... Oh. We're not going that way. Um... I don't think there's a door this way. No, okay. There's only one way to go. Uh, actually, before we do that... Let's, uh... Combine with single shotter. Shotgun's good to go. I got, oh, I got some zappies. Got the zappies locked in there. We're good. We're good. Can't confirm Twisted Souls is a legend. <laughs> For real, my dude. If one speed says someone's a legend, then that holds some serious fucking weight. What's this now? 23rd January 1981. It's been six months since that damn Bertram closed the vault from the inside. I hardly recognize myself anymore. We should have been protected from radiation. We we're supposed to be the chosen ones. What does it mean? Are we not worthy? Our suits have served only to delay the blood poison process. Nothing more. Bertram promised us a cure, but at this point, I don't think there's any hope for me. Oh, God. Yeah, he locked all the cultists down here. And they're probably all dead by now because I was a child. Had to do it. Well, I think to save with. I don't see anything else around here I can use. Alright, before I go through the door, let's check the other path. There's one, one other way to go, I thought. Oh, right here. Hey, bud. <laughs> Screw on a metal cap used to cover pipes. I'm right, glad I got that because we're definitely going to need it. Alright, cool. Now I can feel good going through this door. Well, feel better, not good. We just have to kick with legends like Jerry and Oh, pff, pff. hush! Legends amongst legends. Oh, right there, I see. And you got well. There's different places I can put it. But, alright, so we wanted to... Shouldn't that, like, come out into something? Yesterday I tried pumping gas to a canister, but it didn't matter how much I spun the handle. Not a drop of gas came out even though it was full. I told the boss what had happened and he looked extremely disappointed. He grabbed three small handles and said, wait here, and then left. Came back for two minutes later with a full canister of gas. Jesus. I need to let Jerry sleep and it's 5 a.m. Yo, have a great night once, Speed. I appreciate you, buddy. Get some sleep. And I hope you have a good Tuesday tomorrow for sure. Um, I don't think Tuesday is a streaming day for you, but I'm sure I'll, I'll poke my head in and say hey for sure. At least in the Discord. I got more nails. Combine. Right, that's fully loaded. Alright, I hope this room is a safe room over here. Bunker 2A.
try this door. Get that sleep, yeah. Jesus Christ. Ooh. All right, so that's a trap door. Run. My God. 15 September 1970. We've done it after many failed attempts with previous test subjects. We were able to bring two healthy twin girls into the world. I don't know if we will be capable of repeating this feat, but this is progress. We wait until the subjects turn 10 years old for the sacrifice. For now, these results have brought peace to our members. Jesus Christ. Yeah, 10. It's quite the bunker. Oh, is this where the steps are broken? Yep. Okay, got it. So I don't have a canister to put that gas in yet. So I think I have to keep going down, unfortunately. Because the other way looked like it was blocked. Alright, there they go, all the feet's getting pulled in. This is terrifying. Bunker 3B. How many enemies we're going to have down here? I'm guessing probably a bit. Jeez. Some crosses and shit. Just hanging. God, that is so fucked. The hell is that noise? Oh my god, they're real. <laughs> so many children's shoes. Oh, that's fucked. 12th March 1957. The sacrifices have worked very well after being purified with boiling water. I feel close to the coming of the Creator with each attempt. I'm not playing with that right now. I guess I don't really have an option, huh? Fuck. I have nothing to use for that canister. Okay, so they are human, or at least mortal, so that's good. So they were blocking that, but what else was here? So those beds hovering and shit. Yo, Josh, ADA Stoner, thank you for the raid, appreciate you, welcome in. Um, unfortunately, my, my shout-out bot thing doesn't want to work. Usually it plays a clip. Um, it is not. But everyone, please go, uh, please go check out Josh. Very, thank you very much for the raid. How was, uh, how was your stream? What were you playing? 
As for us, we're just in here trying to beat tormented souls. And I'm um, having a hell of a time trying to get it done. More nails. No shotgun shells, though, I see. Oh my god! That was very close. 15th of September, 1980. The day the sacrifice has come, Noah has taken the girls to the temple. I must finish getting ready to officiate the ritual. Has this suit always felt so heavy over my shoulders? I need a drink. Jeez. I need a sprint. Oh, the hands coming out of the wall. That's so fucked up. They built like a legit whole bunker down here. Probably ran out of electricity a long time ago. Whatever generators they had are long gone. How's it going? Thanks for the follow. Of course, of course. Thanks for thanks for the rating for coming in. So yeah, what game were you playing this evening? Anything good? Check this one. Oh Jesus fucking Christ. I'm out of shotgun shells. It's a heal. Right. Look, I was playing the darkness. Oh, that's a classic. Took care of that. What is this? A door that opens to the prison. This might be important. Ah! Oh, creepy Pastero, welcome in, welcome in. I'm gonna be starting Dead Space for the first time here. So, oh, dude, awesome. I was just talking last stream about how I haven't played it yet. Why? I've played a good chunk of the first one off stream before I was even even started streaming. Oh god. Um, and I really want to replay it, but I need to double check to see if are we getting a reboot in January or is it just a remaster? If it's a remaster, um, I'll probably wait and play the remaster. But if it's a reboot, like look entirely different, then that's something else. All right, time to fight. Fuck. Oh, she's got fucking great. Why did I just hit reload right there? It's beyond me, sorry. All right, we need something better. Not working. Go ahead, shells. That's my last heal. It's a big daddy. <laughs> oh, it's a remaster? Oh, thank you. Appreciate you letting me know. I'll probably wait then, because if it was going to be a reboot, I'd probably play the OG and then play the reboot after. Um, you know, I was always kind of creeped out by it, but I have been streaming more and more horror on my channel. Well, there you go. And that's and that's a good horror to play, too, because, like, you still get protection in terms of weapons, and, like, you know, there's a progression, there's a whole story, like, it's fun. Short, it definitely is a scary game to start off with, don't get me wrong, but... Um, yeah, it's, it's nothing like playing like one of those indie horror games where they just try to fuck with you the whole time. <laughs> oh, I gotta love it. Love to see it. Spreading the love. Torture machines. Alright, cool, cool, cool. Down here, there's an opening. Oh, 
There's something in here. Oh, thank God, health. Ooh, ooh. People got fucked up down here, apparently. People got really fucked up down here, apparently. Holy shit. Indie card games are fun too. I'm always playing those. Oh, that's cool too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't even think I have heard of this game. Um, Torch, yeah, so this one, Tormented Souls, it actually is by indie developers, but it's very... Oh, it's the canister. Yes. It's a very... Um, very heavily inspired by Silent Hill, Resident Evil, those types of uh, styles of games. They must have died right here. G... All right, cool. What's this now? June 6, 1982. <laughs> Hi, Tree. How are you? I hope you're having a lovely evening. It's a pretty awesome game. Yeah, Mr. Roy also played it, too. Um, and he very much enjoyed it, as you can see. It could evening to you, too. We're uh, getting closer by the myth the note fired back. At first, I thought that my brothers did not take off their suits because they still retained hope that we're mitigating the radiation, but now I understand. They know very well that they will find under these rotten ornaments if they took them off. Fetid rotten meat hanging from monstrous bodies. Beating the, <laughs> the shit of his ball bag, of course. I can't take it anymore. This place is living death. I want to pray before I kill myself and in the depths of this cursed place, I mean God can come with this light. Down here exists only evil. That's fucking deep. Alright, we got the canister. Let's get the fuck out of here. This prison is scary as shit. down this way. I think I turned around. I'm almost positive. Bunker 3A. Ooh, first aid. Let's go. I love this game. I hated the puzzle so much. Parasite Evil Dead. Um, yeah, some of the puzzles were really janky. But, um... They give they give decent hints. It's just difficult to figure it out sometimes. How long they were used during the height of the polio outbreak in the fifties? Anyone in there? Uh, that is one in that one. Nothing here. My word, that was fucking terrifying. Um, <laughs> no words. Fuck. Nothing else around here, really? Why are you bringing the Borg from Star Trek? Um, yes! Will you please change the camera angle? I can't do this. Gonna go ahead and equip this. Nothing here. 
Come on, man. You gotta give me something to work with here. Oh, I get some nails. Okay. Better than nothing. I'll take it. Any assistance at this point in time with this game, for Christ's sakes. Um, combine here. Okay. Oh, yeah. oh, I, need, I need that third um, bunker stairs. I need the third. Oh. I needed the third um, gas pipe blocker thingy blocker. The music down here is so creepy, I can't tell if there's actually enemies nearby. Oh, here's the generator. There's no gas in that canister. But apparently that's going to do something. But I don't know where the other plug is going to be. Unless you don't need it, which is all also possible. Low le the lower level is completely flooded. Ah, so it's going to pump the lower level out. Okay. What's the plot so far? To LDR, two sentences max. What if you just took a huge dump of the generator? Would that help? It would, it would not. So basically... This girl here, she had a dream about some twins, and she has a picture of these twins. And she went to this house to investigate, got knocked, got blindsided, woke up in a tub and her eye was missing. And we've determined that basically there's a cult that was at this place, and she has a twin sister, and the, the twins are supposed to be held for sacrifice. Except she basically escaped by accident if that makes sense okay cool I see who we are yep um, hello. and now we're basically below the hospital slash mansion where all this was going down and now we're pretty much at the end game but I'm like I'm like a solid 11 to 12 hours in it's taking me a bit for some of these puzzles can I go up one more floor and then just be right where I need to be? No, this is the staircase that's broken. Yep. Okay. So I have to run through this trap again, I think. Maybe not. Is this the precursor to Dying Light 2? No. What's this? Oh, isn't there a dude over here? Yeah, okay. I hate that. I hate sticky keys. <laughs> Alright, so what's this way that he was guarding? Maybe this is the other, uh... The other piece I need for the gas puzzle. It's also a safe room. Fantastic. Okay. I'm Emma. I remember everything. I fell into the river from the bridge all these years oh, ago. Daddy, yes, to the bad guy. <laughs> Noah is keeping my sister Anna in the underground bunker. He yeah. is the one who has engineered all of this. Yeah. He has had my sister in captivity all this time. I won't let Noah hurt her any longer. Yeah. This ends now. Oh, fuck yeah. Kick your ass, sea bass. 
think it's this way. Bunker 1, 2B. 2B? Or not 2B? That is the question. Oh yeah, here it is. Okay. Cool. So, we want to do a cap here. A cap here. And, mm, there's multiple caps here, I just noticed. Um, let's take them all back. So, what we want to do is we want to get to that pump. Which is here, to the left of that. So you do, oh, excuse me. We need one here. And then we just shut that valve off, turn this valve on, comes around here, and it comes from two different ways. Twisted, my word. Pipe dream, yeah! Thank you for the bits, my friend. Alright, so this, let's block that off so it comes down here. It comes, oh, look at that, it goes back. And then up. And then down. Around. Oh, my word. Uh, okay. So keep that blocked off, it comes over here. Open this up, it comes down. Out. Up. Um, put this cap here. I don't think we need this cap right here because looks like everything is blocked off from getting to it. So I'm gonna hold on to it. Come up here. Keep that blocked off. Goes up here. To, oh, right here. That's where it needs to go. But where does this go? Right here. Oh, back around, and it comes around here. Close that off, so you don't have to worry about closing anything off. I think that does it. Back up, around. That's blocked off, come down here. Blocked off, go back, up, over, down, all the way down. Out, up, blocked. From here, can't go this way, so it has to go all the way over here. Down this way, meets up there. Otherwise, it comes all the way over anyways. Or it goes up and down here. Blocked here. Goes down. This is blocked. Goes all the way down and over here. Great. But then here, it's blocked. That should do it. I don't think I needed that last piece. That's hysterical. Alright. Let's get the gas canister put into place. Pump it. <laughs> Okay, what am I missing here? This is the gas tank. Up here. Like, do we pretend it just doesn't go back that way and it only goes this way? I guess we can do that and then this, and that blocks that off entirely. And then we put this guy here. Block this. It only comes down this way. Let's take this one. Block it. Crank this open. Uh, but no, because then it's going to... Oh, unless you block this off here. But no, it can't. It has to come up this way. It's the only pipe that gets there. So it has to come up this way. This big circle. That's blocked. That's blocked. But it's still going to come down over here. That's the problem. See, this doesn't add up. In the interest of time, I'm going to go look to see what they offer. Oh my god, were you serious? I think I had it.
I never opened the gas canister. <laughs> So I have to go and rebuild this entire thing again. All right, so let's start from scratch, shall we? I'm not. I'm not looking to try to do this in record time, but let's you know, reinvent the wheel a little bit. It is really so come up here, over here, close that off. Come down here, around the back, close this. It has to go back up and around. Open that. Come down here, around back, out forward. Alright, this is where we block the first one. Up here, this is blocked, don't worry about it. Come around here. And we know it's gonna come up here, down here, not hit that. Block that guy. And that'll get us through. But there's other options here that both end up at this point. Whether it's go this way, down and over, or back and down. And then close it. And that should really do it, honestly. I don't see why that wouldn't work. I'm so confused. Clap, clap, clap. Well, I mean, yeah, but... See below for the solution. So they're saying this is off. This is off. Oh, I should say, you know, we'll, we'll say this is north, south, or east, west. North, south, east, west, north, south, north, south. Why is this open? Fine, whatever, you, you made the game, I guess. Or someone made the game. Click that so that's off. And then... But why wouldn't it... That doesn't make any sense. They didn't cap this. And that's right. Where the... So the caps are here? There. there. Maybe there's something I don't understand about physics. Open says a jug. I don't see that at all. That doesn't seem accurate to me. But whatever. We have the gas. Let's go. Now we can go fill this generator up. And that should pump out the lower level, if I recall. Okay. Generator, I think, is one more floor down. Thank you, tree. Okay. Here we are. Now. Um, you know, I shut the lid and didn't even think about, like, oh, maybe I should just leave it open. Don't want to spill it. Alright. Builds up. Where's the cap? gas can be refilled here. I mean, it'd be nice if I could close that. But... Oh. I'm like, what the fuck? Sick. Achievement unlocked. Water. Lovely. Alright, if there's still people, if there's creatures alive down here, then I'm at a loss. This was under fucking water. B5. No doors here. It's still. Oh, that generator's. Generator's gonna keep running, that's right. Now it's actually still pumping. Alright, down to B6. No door here. 
door there. Can't go any further down. It's not pumping any further anyways. This is it. V6. Corridor. What the fuck? Twenty seventh May, nineteen eighty one. Now I see it clearly. Noah lied to us. It was all a lie. He promised to take us away from our tormented lives. Ah, I said tormented. Look at that. He told us that the gods had laid out a sacred path for us. All lies. That thing we called a god is nothing but evil, and the source of the nameless things that creep around in the dark. Yikes. That sucks. But that's cult life for ya. Laid out sacred placentas. Yes, correct. They did everything right. Preparation room. Oh, here we are. It's flapjack titties. Don't tell me that's fucking Anna. Emma, my dear granddaughter. You finally reunite with your sister. Oh no. Flapjack Titties is our sister. Noah. Noah. You survived the fall from the old bridge. This is a divine sign, a true miracle. God tested my faith, and now that I have been found worthy, you have been brought back to me. <laughs> Flapjack Titties. What is your role in all of this? My role? I orchestrated all of it. Fourteen years ago, I made a mistake that I have regretted every single day. This time, I won't let you escape. I have you just where I want you. Shoot him. What the hell are you talking about? It is finally time for the ritual. With your and your sister's blood, we will finally witness the birth of our savior. I'm good. In his endless grace, he will make me the new pope, the supreme the pontiff. Pope. Every conceited prick in the Vatican will rot in this stinging town. Good lord. Let's talk more shooting. You yeah. are insane. You killed my dad, and because of you, your own daughter and my sister Anna have been poisoned by that damned radiation. What kind of monster are you? A monster? You call me a monster? I was willing to sacrifice everything I loved in the name of the Creator. That makes you a monster. He will be born again to purify the earth of these unholy souls. Only the true heirs of the kingdom of God will prevail and create a new world. Are you going to be a part of it? I don't think so. After what your sister did to her eyes, I thought we would never be able to open the vault again. You two are the last remaining twins with the sacred blood. I must thank you for giving me access to this place. Mm. I could not have done it by myself. But you, to take one of your eyes out? That was absolutely genius. I told you the protagonist for sending her lines from a cute card in the middle of a boss fight. I won't <laughs> let you use my sister and me for your sinister purposes. There is nothing you can do to stop it. We are the Polux sect, descendants of the ones that brought light and darkness. We are the heirs chosen to reign above every being that walks this earth. You are insane. This time, there's no bridge to jump from. Rejoice! You are about to fulfill your sacred destiny. Okay. There's no running away. I don't plan to run away. I'm coming for you. I'm coming for you. Catch her! Prepare the twins for the blood offering! Oh boy, I'm gonna have to kill a bunch of things. It's not gonna work right because I don't have like any ammo. Oh boy. Two of them, three of them, four of them. Yeah. This will work well. Stuff 
in here, I can grab, I can see them. Good thing they're very slow. Oh boy. Now what do we got? We've got two charges of this shit. Shells, nice. Right. Oh boy. Nothing. And health, nice. Shit. Oh boy. How many charges do I have left in that? One. Okay. Shotgun time. Shotgun time. Let's combine. I didn't equip. Oh my god. Get up, bitch. What do you have over there? What's that? Is that the key to the front fucking door? Oh my god, it is. That's to the front door. Sick. It's also to this, apparently. Take it back. Take it back now, y'all. Oh, Anna. This is my sister. She shouldn't have to live like this. Night, Anna. Flapjack titty. Is that he also used to make pancakes? No, flesh flapjacks. <laughs> he lift them up to see if there's loot. That is, that's fucked. Huh. That's my sister you're talking about, you know. Alright, so there's nothing else here I can grab in terms of ammo or anything like that. Damn it. Let's see. We've got one shot. And six things to heal with. Why does Priest keep getting away so fast, by the way? Why are we going? I don't want to go further down. Come on. Graveyard, they call it. Safe room. Great. Save it up. I'm very shocked I got through those four dudes that easily. It helps that they were slow. Progress has been saved. Alright. Um. What? Oh. I was <laughs> like, uh. What do I do now? Okay, into the slaughter room. Jesus Christ. I don't have one of those in my house. Can I maybe get a different camera view to see what I'm walking into here? Since, you know, thought. Quite the staircase, though, and some ancient fucking sculptures. Uh oh. 
Oh, it's just an elevator. Never mind. That's great. Here we go. What the fuck is that? Man, I stapled his arm back. You got through those four dudes like Piper Fawn. <laughs> so, you killed those fools? They were not worthy of the Polex sect after all. This is over, Noah. Your gruesome dream ends here. Without the blood of the twins, you won't be able to bring that thing back to life. I have waited so long to revive our savior. I will show you that my faith has no limit. That's not going to happen. Oh, my child, if only you had faith. Oh, no. That's not twin blood, that's the same blood. I'm not too sure that's how that works. If so, he could have done that a long time ago, but okay. The fuck. Great. Well, that was my one shot. Got any, uh... Oh, here we go. Woohoo! Nice dodge. Dodge, dip, duck, dive, dodge. Oh, I see. First off. Uh, second off, we're going to combine the gear. Quick. Uh, it doesn't work. That's stupid. Use the crowbar, I guess. Dude, what? What's the point of having that? What's the point of these things? Like, you can't fucking hit them. I never healed myself. I'm a moron. So, I don't know. I, I shot nails at it. Like... I... I don't know. But this, this is definitely endgame right here, though, which is great because it is just shy of 1 in the morning. Hopefully we can get this done so. Alright, I know I can sprint through this because this is just building up anticipation. The elevator, there it is. Run forward. Skip it. You know he's so dead. So dumb. Like, what am I supposed to use on it? So. 
So combine with here. Okay, I can't use these things on it. Let's keep looking around. There's gotta be something else. Health kit, that's nice. More shotgun shells. Another one. Oh, I couldn't get out of the way in time. Alright, tell you what, we're just gonna use one of the goodies to go right back to five. It's an ugly fuck. That's not going anywhere. Ah! Wait, that drill up top. Oops. Maybe that's what that those things do, but I don't know what to do with them. Like there's fucking shits in the way. I tried shooting the big dude, did, did nothing. It is. Thank you. None, none of the rest of the music in this game was that loud. I like my atmosphere. Like I like my suffering. Ah, shit. Um, okay, so did that, did that, did that. In order to defeat the boss, you need to interact with three wheels around the area. These are protected by bulge. You cannot be attacked until you weaken the boss. I shot the thing and it did nothing. Six nails will do. Now attack one of the bulbs either with a single lance charge or by hitting twice with a crowbar and dodging backwards. Once the bulb disappears, quickly attack with the wheel so the bulb doesn't grow. Grab it again. Ba -ba -ba. Jesus. This is, uh. This is quite the boss fight here. You gonna spit back? Oh, fucker! That was good timing on your part. Okay.
Okay. They said two shots of this fucking thing was gonna kill it. It's uh, both, both Satan, both. This this boss fight sucks. <laughs> Here, do puzzles while you're fighting. Why? I see no reason for that. Okay, so don't die. Ooh, ooh. You know, I think you're onto something. So I thought I was stopping it one gear at a time, but apparently you have to just time it right and get the thing to go through all three at once. And while you're doing that, change out the syrup of the soda machine. Oh, but that's easy. Ba 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 Great. I need to get the nails first. Aw, oh, you fucking bastard. Why are you shooting so fast now? What is this garbage? Wow, how'd you miss? Alright, and the second one's up there. Another first aid kit. Here's the last one. There are shotgun shells here. Hello? Hello? Okay, that was outrageous. Okay. Got everything I need for now, then. Combine. Whip. Dun 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 This music starts over. Okay, come on. We just have to line this up right, apparently. And I'm not getting hit while this is happening either, which is very interesting. fucking kidding me with this shit. Oh, it's coming. This is it. Nope. Oh, no! Fucking shit! It does... The last time I did that, it went through and hit the wall and immediately just bounced me out. That is stupid. And now it's back. You fuck. Now you're auto firing? And now that doesn't even get hurt. 
Because I have to go and reshoot this fucking thing now. The gameplay was great up until this point. This is just absolute garbage. Oh, wait. What? I want you to shoot this. Why did you turn around? Skip, skip, let's go. And then the the, the, the walkthrough guide's like, oh, two crowbar shots will do it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, so I'm just gonna do this one by one and that should be fine. So dumb. Ooh. Got nailed. What? What? Hold the fucking phone. What's up with the auto fire? I have to hurt it again. And I have a whopping 13 shots left. Healed while you got hit, that seems like a bug. I mean, I guess. No! Oh my god. Shoot this thing. I'm not even hitting it. There's no sound effect too far away. <laughs> Alright, I have to crowbar the fuck out of it. I have exactly three shots left in this thing. Oh, well, I have shotgun shells too. Those will work. But, like, for fuck's sakes, man. Take it. Auto fired right after. See, boom, healed, boom. Like, yeah, that's stupid. It's definitely a bug. I'm gonna get hit again. Fortunately, I'm I'm okay in terms of health, as in not about to die. Backing up. Nope, didn't matter. Like I understand if the fire rate goes up as I'm getting further into killing this thing, because it's getting like pissed off. Nice, that was enough. That was convenient. Come on, baby. One more. Got it. Things toast. Bye. But I ran out of nails. 
<laughs> it's over, Noah. How many girls were sacrificed for that, that thing? Those bastards won't hurt anyone ever again. Oh, how convenient the bridge fell for me. Wait a minute, where'd Noah go? He just fell down right here. Okay. Where does D&D module yet? <sighs> Alright, well... I already fucking killed... Flapjack Titties, the sister. So, apparently you can save her if you have an antidote. Uh, no idea what an antidote would have been. Sewer. Okay. Oh, I okay, I know where to go. We'll go back to the other door. I like how the music's like all chill now. Like, you won't find anything else that'll be scary. If they... F <laughs> Better not screw with me at this point. Okay, we're gonna go to this door over here. The pumping room. Yep. And then we head upstairs to the office. Oh, the body's gone. That's cool. Pumping gas or pumping titties? Uh, both. We'll go through the meeting room. Main hall, yep. Down the stairs. Well, that can't go there anymore, huh? Or there. Or there. Wow, they really are. Close you off. Alright. Boom. Doors open. Nostalgia achievement unlocked. What are you waiting for? Go! <laughs> After all, no matter how hard we want it, we can't change the past. Oh, left the, uh, the light back there. Credits. There we go. Okay. So, um, good, good game. Um, definitely had the nostalgia feel of the old Resident Evil 2, Sound Hill 2 games. Um, story was good. Kept me going. Um, I had a feeling that we were somehow involved with the twin scenarios. Like, we were probably one of the twins or whatever. Like, that wasn't surprising. The, um, having the, uh, the priest, Noah, being the grandfather, though, that was something I wasn't anticipating, so I thought that was pretty cool. Um, the, unfortunately, that, the last boss fight, while the, the idea was there, and it was like, okay, cool, it was just the, the mechanisms there were just not, and weren't great. <laughs> Um, and some of the puzzles were really aggressive in terms of, all right, this is getting louder, isn't it? No, it's not. Okay. It felt like it was. Yeah. So there's a lot of, um, a lot of puzzles that were a lot more ridiculous, if you ask me. 
So I got the remorse ending. In order to get the remorse ending, so we do not administer the antidote to the monster. Defeat the last boss, escape like in the forgetfulness ending. This tro uh, trophy was glitched in the earlier version. was fixed in patch 103. However, if you have an earlier version, you will not be able to unlock this. Interesting. Forgetfulness ending is... You will have to use the antidote on the monster, same as in the adoption ending. However, if you're feeling the boss, do not save Anna in the past and simply go to the main hall and leave through the front door. Alternatively, you can simply use the scapel on the monster, which will force you into the forgetfulness ending. There's no trophy tied specifically to this ending, however. That's pretty funny. And then the other version is you give her the antidote. It reveals a pair of bolt cutters. Grab them, they continue down the elevator, but take note of this at the point of no return. In the grimmer, you'll find a recording tape, the final save point, as well as the duplicate collectible, blah, 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 blah. Here's the defeat the boss. Head back through the areas until you reach the meeting room. All the other paths will be blocked off. This is where you make the second decision that changes the endings. For the good ending, use the VHS tape experiment room to return to Anna. Oh, yeah, because she was in the, the jail cell. Fuck. Use the bolt cutters on her cell and talk to her. After the cutscene, use the cross key on the front door to leave and finish the game. I didn't even think of that. Oh, okay. That's that is clever. I'll give him that. See results. You sucked. Uh, let's see. Total time, 11 and a half hours. 15 saves. Defeated over 70 enemies. Metal Kids found 6. Oh, this is plus. No, it's just a weird symbol. Travel distance, 19,000 meters. So about 90.7 kilometers. Damage received, 1180. Main books completed, one ending forgetfulness with two pluses. Ranking is four pluses. I don't know what that means. Um, I don't know what that means. Oh, this is... Uh, oh, no, I did that. Yeah, I did that. This is the... You have to touch that portrait three times and then walk around the helmet five times. I did that thanks to Roy. Okay, cool. All right. So that does it for our uh, our dear friends over at Tormented Souls. I'm glad I finally played it. Um, and uh, it, it is over now. I will definitely be working on a, a highlight reel on it at some point and trying to um, get it up to the masses. I got a lot of video editing to do, <laughs> to say the least. Um, but yeah, so this is going to be the end of the stream for tonight. Um, and as I mentioned, the start of the stream, for those who weren't here, uh, I'm leaving with Treebeard Wednesday morning, um, going to Baltimore for Maryland Death Fest. So I will not be on tomorrow night. I'll be sleeping ahead of the uh, early morning rise for travel on Wednesday. And then I'll be home very late Memorial Day slash Tuesday morning. Um, as long as things go well, I'll probably be back Tuesday night. Otherwise, looking probably towards Thursday. Uh, I will have a blast MDF. Having to be in bed at like 10. Ah, same. Same. <laughs> so, um, really quick, let me just see who we can raid at this, uh, lovely hour of quarter past one in the morning. Let's find out, shall we? <laughs> okay. So I'm concerned either we can... We can go and hit up um, RK Gaming. They're, they're playing something. It just says games and demos. It says deep in the mine. So it could be hidden deep. It could... I know. I can just look. What's wrong with me? Like, sometimes I worry about myself. <laughs> I have no idea what the fuck they're playing. Going to bed, catch when you get back. Oh, all right, dude. Thank you so much. I appreciate you as always, of course. And I will definitely be seeing you when I get back. Fuck it. I guess we'll just, uh, we'll send it over to RK Gaming. I usually send it to Heavy. But, uh, we'll switch to RK. Keep that horror shit going. Um, so, again, thank you all for hanging out. Um, I'm going to be extending the 
rage stream uh, channel points goal because obviously another week vacation <laughs> I'm away um, but yeah we'll we'll eventually get to that I think we're like 70 71 percent what is it really 72 percent so we're getting close we're getting close um, Tormented Souls is done um, I'll do a lot of thinking about what's next uh, if anyone has any ideas please go to discord go to the game recommendations channel let me know what, I th you, what you think I should be playing and I will go from there. But uh, otherwise, have a great night and I'll see you in a week. Stay calm. Stay calm. 100%.